Hey, good to see you one times again. And today's video, I'm going to share with you one of the simple, but actually it is big. Okay, it's a, it's a kind of tough integral of that. But after you're watching this, I'm guarantees you will know how easy it is. Okay, so let's jump to the answer. Well, like you can see on the screen, there are two separate parts. So the right hand side, which is the discussion part, and the left hand side, which is the answer part. Okay, let us cast together. So here the problem, like you can see one times again. So what we're going to figure out is to calculate that, okay, as an integral. So most of the time people try to integrate this by using integral by part, but you know, it's hard or it rarely get the answer and it's go on and go on. And today's you will know the new ways of calculate this integral. Okay, let figure out together. So here I write the integral one times again, like you can see. So I'm going to discuss about that. How could we possibly integrate that? So just to remind you that the lens x, y equal to lens x plus lens y. So possibly I, um, you know, I say ln is lens to represent logarithms, which is, um, you know, it's, it's a kind of, um, you know, multiplication here and where you separate it together, you get um, plus, okay, you get plus over there. So it's the properties of Lucarism. So um, maybe you have to, is a kind of remember this, maybe it's benefit to solve our integral. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to separate, okay, I'm going to separate this part together where you can see um, 2x here, I can write len 2 plus len x, okay? And the same time, at the same time, I also separate the downside where is the denominator. Okay, so I'm going to separate where len four plus len x there, and this part they x over x. I put it within the same, right? Okay. So what are we going to do next in this case? So let me tell you something in this. What I'm going to do is I'm going to add more len four. So why I'm going to do that? Because I want to simplify in this thing, okay? I want to simplify because, you know, in order to calculate, we try to make it as short as possible in there. So in this case, when I, you know, when I put len four in there, so I could write two len two. So if I take this and minus this, it will remain len two the same, right? So it's something that I want to add more or it can be the hint to solve this integral, all right? So after I do this, what I'm going to do is what? Okay, it's to separate it two part, right? To separate it two part. So what I'm going to get is this one, I get the x over x where I time it in, okay? Because this one, when you divide together, you get one. So one time the x over x minus this one, because this one is remain, you know, it's um, len two over there. So I put it in the same and the denominator is len four plus len x there and time the x over x and that is the things. But actually I can easily get this. since I know the formulas of integral the x over x equal to lens of the absolute y u of x over there. So I got this. And since this one is a constant, I can go, you know, I can take um, in front of the integral, so where it's easily to can we can see it. Okay, we can calculate it easily. So, how do we integrate this together? Okay, so where in order to make it easy, I separate into another part where I'm going to take this to integrate um, which other side. So. What are we going to discuss is what if I let the value of t equal to the downside equal to the denominators of the, the, the fractions. So I let the value of t equal to len 4 plus len x there, okay? So what I'm going to do is to 
to do derivative of t. So if I do derivative of t, so here, because this one is a constant, so when I do derivative, it remains zero. And this one, when I do, do derivative, it will get one of x, the x. So can you see something cool here? Seeing, you know, it's the same, right? So you can just substitute the x of x here into the dt. And see, I know that something that I let, len4 plus len x equal to t, right? So that's it, that's it. So I can substitute the value of t over there. And so now it's, you know, it's going to be easy, right? Because it's staying the formula. We can integrate it easily. So we integral it, we integrate it. So it's remain len, you know, the absolute value of t in there. So since I know the value of t that I laid it before is equal to what? Len 4 plus len x, right? So now we can get that, the integrate of that equal to, to that, right? So what I'm going to do is to substitute into the main, the main parts of that, right? So like you can see, I'm going to write in this part in state, right? Okay, so in here, this is the first part and this is the second part that we we take into integrate set that the value that it equal right but seeing this thing we can combine it together by using this formula right okay so from the addition to multiplication you can just make into len 4x there plus c so and that is the answer okay let me know if you have different way to solve this problem comments in the comment box below and thank you for watching. Don't forget to click subscribe in order to get more math tips and math outstanding video. Thank you.